Does my golden conure get along with other parrots? Hi, I'm Caitlin, the author of The Parrot Bliss Bomb. Please be sure to get your copy on Amazon.com so that you can learn everything you need to set everything up so that you give everything your, to your parrot that they need so you have a blissful bond with them. Um, golden conures are amazing. Uh, this is Binks. He is four months old. And golden conures are very social. Now, all parrots are, but golden conures are actually even more so in the sense that they are communal breeders. That means that if you want to breed golden conures, generally speaking, you have to have like a colony or at least like three. Two, I don't know if it would work at all. So what's interesting about that is that makes golden conures a little more unique because in some ways, don't eat the microphone. That's raindrop by Parrot Let. Um, in some ways, they're not as likely to be a one person bird. What is a one person bird? Generally speaking, a parrot. I, the last time I was at the vet, the vet was explaining to someone who had just gotten a blue and gold macaw that, um, no bean tea, that their blue and gold macaw was making friends with them and with the guy and not his wife and not the kids because parrots are very much one person birds. So that means that in the wild, the, their flock could have five members, it could have 20, it could have a hundred, it could have several thousand, but they're only gonna have one bonded mate. And that one bonded mate is the one that they're really gonna connect with um, and they're really gonna bond with. The, the others are like there and they're in the flock and it's all good, but they don't really interact with them. And they can get protective. This is my mate, no touchy, no looky, mine. Which is totally what Tico does with Binks. But because Binks is communal, for example, I have Raindrop grooming my hair. I think she's looking to make a nest. And Binks doesn't seem to care. When I had a second golden conure, uh, Binks and Orobello were like this. They really took to each other. And then when um, when Tico, my yellow naked Amazon, was out, or, or um, Binks out bonded with him as well. Oh, oh, don't climb my throat. It's not so good for me. So right now you'll watch, you'll see Tico going down, and Tico's like, oh, well. <laughs> Chico goes right down to him because he's like, that's my bird. And you could see that Binks doesn't even seem to notice Raindrop. Uh, at one point, Raindrop, oh, this is going to be good. At one point, Raindrop landed on him. He didn't seem to care. I don't usually let my parrot lets out with my bigger birds because the lets are so little and I don't want anything to happen to them. And this is pretty interesting. Binks is just, I, I feel like he's predisposed to like other parrots. We'll see if he's going to make me eat my words right now. What are you doing, Binksy? What are you doing? What are you doing? Are you making a friend? Are you making a friend? So if you have golden conure and you're looking to get another parrot, I think that you're going to be able to add <clears throat> another parrot. And I don't think it doesn't matter what parrot you get. I do think that they're, you know, you might want to get to know parrot personalities and sort of try to match them. Binks is mellow, but also very, um, in a way, very playful. A playful mellow, if that makes sense. Like my kikes are like active playful. And he's, he's not quite like that. Um, so you might want to try to match that. But I always recommend if you're going to get a second parrot, I would get a second golden. First of all, they're one of the most awesome parrots. And second of all, um, they do bond with each other in a way that's different than any other parrot. So when I had the second golden, um, Binks and Orbello, hey, go flying if you're going to fight me. Um, they, they really, they just melted into each other. It was really awesome. And Binks really does like Tico. 
But um, the, the bonding that happens when they're the same species is just phenomenal. And you can see that, oh, what's going on? You can see that um, Binks, even though he has bonded with other parrots, granted he's young, he still bonds with me because I spend time with him. So I hope that helps if you have a golden and you're looking at a second parrot, or if you have a parrot and you're looking to add a second parrot, uh, like a golden, chances are this social butterfly is gonna work out for you. Thanks for joining me. If you have any questions about parrots, please be sure to post below or join my Facebook group, um, Parrot Bliss Flock, and you could post your question there. Happy holidays, and we'll see you next time. Oh, what you doing? All right. Bye.